good morning children so today in our math class we will see expanded form how to write short form skip counting and even and odd numbers okay children okay so what we have seen in last class we have seen about writing play numbers number names and the place value s yes? s yes. so today so what is the first one given for you find the numbers represented in the abacus by writing their place value okay so what you have to do is you have to see what number is allotted for the place value okay so for hundreds place what number is allotted what digit is there for in hundreds place 3 3 beats you have in the abacus so it will have 3 hundreds and how many digits do you have in uh, tens place 1 2 3 4 okay so four beats you have in tens place so four tens and what the digit you will have in ones place ones one and two okay so two ones so the number will be for three hundreds it will be three hundred plus four tens that is forty and two ones equal to two okay so three hundred plus forty plus four so all together so three forty and two when you add up all these things what will you get zero plus zero plus two will be two zero plus four and here you don't have any number so it will be anything added with uh, any number added with zero is the same number yes or no so three only three is there here so three hundred and forty two okay so now coming to the next one what uh, how many beats do you have in hundreds place Yes, one, two, three, four, four hundreds. Then, how many uh, beats you have in tens place? Two, two tens. Then, one, one. Okay. So now four hundreds will be four hundred plus two tens will be twenty. Plus one. When you add up, this is ones place. Okay, so one plus zero plus zero gives one. Then here you don't have any number. So tens place two and zero. Two plus zero is two. Then you don't have any number here. Here only digit in hundreds place is four. Okay, children. so this is how you have to expand the number okay so expand the given numbers into ones tens and hundreds so according to the place value you have to split the number clear children okay so you see here 2 4 6 2 is in hundreds place 4 is in tens place and 6 is in ones place okay so how will you read this number 246 so 246 means 2 is in hundreds place no so 200 200 hundreds are there then 4 tens so 40 how will you expand 200 by reading the number itself you can say 2 hundreds you have 40 and 6 you have 200 plus 40 plus 6 clear children so 570 Five hundred plus seventy. You don't have any ones place. So if in ones place you have to allot with zero. Clear, children. So suppose if they have given the uh, expanded form, if the number is given enlarged, okay. So how will you um, kind of simplify that number? How will you write that in a simple way, in a short form? So write the simplified form of the number of the given expansion: three hundred plus ninety plus eight. So what will it give? Three hundred plus ninety plus eight is three hundred and ninety-eight. Clear, children? So this, that is what written here. See, 
in simple way if you want to say say so i'll say for the second one 200 plus 50 plus 6 that is your question so first write the place value ones tens and hundreds in ones place what do you have only 6 in tens place you what, what do you have 5 so in hundreds place what do you have 2 so 200 you have 50 you have So and six you have so the number is two hundred and fifty six. Then coming to skip counting, starting from any given number. Example: ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So these numbers are arranged continuously. Okay, so that is skip counting in ones. So you need no need of changing any set of numbers. You don't want to skip any numbers. Okay. So now the, see the second one, sixty-two, then sixty-four. What is the missing here? Sixty-three. So uh, you have to uh, skip count in twos. Okay. So every second number you have to count. So sixty-two, sixty-four. Then you have to leave one one digit. You have to leave in between. Okay. So sixty-three will be left and sixty-four is written. Sixty-five is left and sixty-six is written. Sixty-seven is left and sixty-eight is uh, written, and it goes on. Okay, children. Okay. So now come to the next page. So in this, you just observe this. Uh, complete the following by skip counting in fives, tens, and hundreds. By seeing the numbers, uh, first two numbers compare the numbers. Okay. So here two fifty is given. Here two fifty-five is given. Okay. So how many digits are excluded here? Four digits. Okay, four numbers are sorry, four numbers are excluded. So so two fifty one is not written, two fifty two is not written, two fifty three is not written, two fifty four is not written. Every fifth number is written. So it is skip counting in fives. So first observe the number, first two numbers. Find the difference between these two numbers and then. find out what counting is that and continue writing for the remaining sets okay clear children so all these things i told you in basic class itself yes or no so even numbers odd numbers expansion for expanded form short form everything i have i told you in uh basic class itself okay you have learnt already so you just recall everything okay children okay now coming to odd and even numbers what did i say to you uh, when while teaching about odd and even numbers whatever number it may be it may be a two digit number it may be a three digit number four digit number whatever it may be so you have to check the last digit that is in ones place units place so the numbers which is ending with the last digit should be One, three, five, six, seven, and nine. Na sorry, one, three, five, seven, and nine. Na it is odd number. Okay, so the numbers ending with zero, two, four, six, eight. Na it is even numbers. Okay, children. Okay, so now see here what is given here. Circle the even numbers. So what is even numbers? The or last digit. Well, that is in ones place should be should have zero, two, four, six, and eight. So, what are the digits have? Uh, what are the numbers have zero, two, four, six, eight in the last eight? Here you have nine in ones place, so you can't circle that. Here you have zero. Zero is obviously even number. So seventy. Then four. Four is all, uh, of course, an even number. So you can encircle that. Nine is not an even number. So here circle the odd numbers. So what is odd number? Number ending with one, three, five, seven, and nine are odd. So here it is a single digit. So this is one's place. So seven is an odd number. Here six is in one's place. It is not an odd number. Here three is in one's place. It is an odd number. One is in one uh, one's place and it is an odd number. Four is in one's place. It is not an odd number. So what are the odd numbers and even numbers? 
you have to encircle it here you have to circle even numbers here you have to circle odd numbers do this as homework children okay thank you